Hi guys, welcome back. My name's Samantha and this is The Budget Mom UK. Welcome back guys. Um, so as you'll have seen by the title of this video, things are getting changed up, like seriously, getting changed up uh, and I'm going to go into that really really uh, shortly before I do, as always, big shout out to you guys. Um, the, the changes that I'm going to make today are because of your support, your encouragement, your ideas and I just feel like you've got my back <laughs> and um, it's because of you I want to make these changes and that I want to do well, basically. So I mentioned in my last couple of videos things that were going to get changed up in October. I didn't feel like I could do it part way through the month just because it just didn't feel like the right time. You know, it's a learning curve. I'm learning and um, as I'm doing each each week and doing different things, I'm learning and discovering things that work for me and discovering things that don't, basically. Um, and with that in mind, this is where all these different tweaks and things are coming. Um, it's so nice to see some of the other fellow budgeters as well following and commenting. And I do, um, you know, I've got to quite a lot of you guys' videos and I subscribe and I watch. And I'm learning from you as well, so thank you for that. Uh, yeah, so let me just get into this. Um, it's a really short and sweet video, but it's just letting you know of everything that's going to be coming up over the next month, basically. Um, so, if you are new, um, this is what my typical bill tracker looks like. And to be honest, this isn't changing too much. I've made a few tweaks um, where previously I had um, all my subscriptions bundled together. I've sort of set them out now, um, let's space them out, um, where previously, like I've watched some really good videos, some really useful ideas, I'm like, why am I not doing this already? So the idea being uh, popping down my budget and then on the date that it actually comes out, writing the date and writing the actual amount because previously I was doing that at the end. Um, and yeah, I just felt like, it because it's more of a real time, real time happening now, um, tracker, it's, it's right in the moment. So it allows you to be far more accountable and ready and prepared. Um, and you could see then what I'm doing and where my money's going and when it's going and how I'm making that work. Um, I've moved, have moved a couple of things off that. I'll get to that in a second. Um, these have pretty much stayed the same as were. I've popped holidays on the family. Yeah. There is one other new envelope that's going to be going on there. Um, I haven't put it on yet. But basically, like, since I set this up, I opened myself a second Etsy store. I already had one which just sells like some Disney prints and logos and quotes and Harry Potter things, basically, and candles and other bits. Um, but based off the back of setting these up and you, you guys asking me for them, um, opened another Etsy store. And oh my gosh, guys, you have been so supportive, so generous, and um, basically, it's, it's like a mini extra income like I looked at how much I made this last week and um, it's such a boost and a bonus and so needed and I'm like it's great but that said I've been like getting resources and I feel like I need a little pocket envelope for any resources and things I need, I need to go and buy because I've been super naughty as well this is the other thing and I'll, I'm going to be completely honest this week has been a bit of a write-off it has been a write-off because even though I've had my envelopes, I've just sometimes I've forgotten to take it with me, and I've just been hitting my uh, my, my debit card because I know there's cash in there, or um, a couple of things have just gone online, like very. Um, just I've just been really silly this week, and I need to hold my hands up, and I need to be accountable, and that's what's happening with this now. So basically, I'm going to lose my debit card. I'm going to lose, once I've got my money out, I'm going to put that debit card somewhere 
Oh wait, I'm very good at losing it. I could just give it to the one year old and he loses it for me quite regularly. There's a thought. Um, but yeah, I'm just I'm just gonna have to leave it at home because it's just been really tempting this week and just too easy. Too easy. Uh, I'm being honest with you because, you know, well, why not? I'm no point otherwise, is it? So yeah, that's that. So I'm gonna be looking at that, that's gonna change. So obviously that video's not going out just yet, it's taken a few days. I haven't filmed it, I haven't done anything with it, it's not October yet, but it'll be out soon. Um, so with that in mind, I, I am Bernard, this is the other thing, was because I'm, because I'm now doing okay with Etsy, and I know that's a really massively variable income, like one week I can make nothing, that's okay. Um, it's not okay, you know. Um, but basically, I thought, well, do I save it all and pay myself at the end of a month, the beginning of a month, or do I pay it weekly? I've decided to pay it weekly for now. I'm going to see how it goes. I might change after October. I might go, no, it's not working. Um, and then, yeah, and just using that a lot, really, to chip away into my sinking funds. So anything bonus, you know, that's what that's going to be used for. Um, so, yeah, so that's the other change that's coming in. Um, so fingers crossed that keeps growing and you, you guys keep being amazing and everything else, so um, that's that. Now, you will have seen one of these already uh, previously. This one I've coloured a lovely festive Halloween-y black and orange. Um, and yeah, so previously which what I've done is fill in what's happening um, over the month, so I know if I'm going out, if I need to be somewhere, if I've got an appointment, Whatever, so I know what's coming up, and I know what I'm gonna need to put. So I need to put extra in a different envelope, for example. Um, and that's fine. But what I'm going to be doing is um, I've seen a few people do it, and I think actually that's really quite useful. Um, yours is yours. <laughs> you guys this tend to be spread over two uh, pages. Um, for me, I prefer the one. I like it all just together. It confused me a few times when I was watching some of the videos. I was like. I'm sure they've just had a no spend day. Why has it disappeared? Oh yeah, it's on a separate piece of paper, whatever. Um, but I thought it would be useful for me to be looking at this as well each week and really sort of going for those no spend days, if you like. So I'm going to be doing that. Um, and also making a note of those bills, those dates when they come out, uh, so I can see that they definitely come out. I, and I, again, that's it's the accountability thing, isn't it? So those will be going on there. Um, I've seen people got like really cute stickers. I thought about doing those. Um, I'm not 100% set yet on how I'm going to do it, whether I use stickers or whether I just write on it. And um, I've got a few days to, yet to decide on that, but that's going to be a lot more active going forward, basically. Now, after this week, and I said I've stripped a lot of stuff on my very account, on my um, credit card and things like that. And I've also had the, the Attachy one, we remember the kitchen that I don't even own anymore, that I'm still paying off and it's on a silly, well I think it's a silly interest amount. And I promised that the month, my target for this month, because if you look through my September one, um, I wrote in there my target was to stop that out or get a, a, a lower amount of interest basically for that. So um, if you want to know how I got on with that and what I did, that'll be in my week one October video. I'll tell you about that. Um, but yeah, I just thought this would be really useful. Again, I've seen something similar, created my own, uh, to put down the debt name, the debt type. So basically, whether it's, you know, is it clothes? Is it a holiday? Is it a kitchen that I don't own? Right. Um, so that's going to go on there. And um, just sort of, I keep saying this, it's the visual thing and keeps coming back to it. And if it's in, your, in, if it's in, in your face, you're more likely to do something about it, right? Um, so if I'm seeing this every week, week in, week out, I'm looking at it, I'm going, right, what else am I doing? What am I doing? Um, and yeah, I think it'll just encourage me to do more, basically. So that's the next new thing. Um, I have come up with this, um, which I've seen similar again, where I've got this two here. One is my bill envelope and one is my cash envelope. So if I look back at this one, and um, basically, 
fill envelope is these ones and looking at the total that needs to go in them. So the budget amount is going to go in this total bit. Um, it's cash breakdown basically, so a bit like you know in the cash tracking card that we've got. Um, so when I go to the bank, I know exactly what I've got. Um, and similar for my cash envelope breakdown as well, which are the, the fluid envelopes, my sinking funds. There's an option there for them as well. And I've just put on my how are you feeling this week. Um, you know, sometimes like you can look at your funds and go, do you know what I'm having? Such a good week. And you'll write that down. And it's it's nice to know. And, and then when you look back and you think, well, that'll, that'll be why. I've had, I've had a really good week because I was able to put so much money in such a place or whatever. Or like this week, I would be writing down going, I feel a bit like a failure, to be honest. Um, I know I'm only human and... Um, you know, we do these things and yeah, um, so that would probably go down in there and I might even put a comment down about why. I have had a few personal reasons maybe, you know, when you just feel bad and you're like, do you know what, maybe I do need that. <laughs> maybe I do need to buy myself theatre tickets. Maybe I do need to buy myself a really nice bag. I haven't bought those things, but I did buy theatre tickets. What are you going to do? Um, yeah, so I just thought this would be a really useful, um, more, more, more detailed, more clear, more um, intricate, um, and just, just for you guys to really see the nitty gritty, like, um, just down to the penny as well, that's the other thing, just because I just, it wasn't, it wasn't specific enough. Like it was, I've generalised it, or to so like here where I put 450 instead of actually putting the actual amount, say whether it's 449, 20, I don't know, whatever. I was still grinding it up. I just think for the sake of clarity and honesty and transparency, it needs to be, it needs to be done. It needs to be done, basically. So, yeah, so I'm starting again. I'm starting again. I'm, you know, drawing a line this week. And we're going to go from there. And I really hope you guys will come along with me on this journey. Um, I don't think I would make these changes without your support. And so for that I am honestly really, really grateful. Um, but yeah, this is where we're going to be going. So that um, week one of October will be coming out Wednesday. Because I'll have it all planned and tracked by then. Um, and you'll see when my money comes in. And it's, it's going to be really detailed really useful i hope and yeah i just think it's a, a good change a good change so thank you so much again for joining me and again if you've enjoyed what you watch if you want to see the changes you want to see what's going on next i'd really appreciate your support subscribing and clicking the little notification bell um but yeah other than that i will see you next time bye